Nothing comes easy in March, but Wisconsin's road to the Final Four has been unprecedented. Unfortunately, they tried to become the first team to beat a 16, an 8, a 4, a 2, and back-to-back -back one seats en route to cutting down the nets. That run came just a little bit too short tonight. A final in Indianapolis, 68 to 63. The Badgers fall to the Duke Blue Devils. They were in search of their first national championship since 1941. Frank Kaminsky finished with 21 points. Tyus Jones had over that, had about 23 to 25 points, waiting for a final on that. Duke pulled away thanks to their play of their backcourt, and it was just simply too much for Wisconsin. And now we will join Dan Needles, who is live out in Indianapolis with more. Dan, not the finish we were hoping for in Wisconsin. What went wrong for, for the Badgers? I tell you what, uh, Stephen, the, the name Grayson Allen, I'm sure not many Badger fans knew who this guy was before tonight, but man, did he have a tremendous second half for Duke. The Blue Devils were in serious trouble. The Badgers led 48 to 39. Duke's two best players. Justice Winslow and Okafor, Jalil Okafor, both had three fouls. And then later Okafor picked up a fourth. So it looked like everything was in the Badgers' favor, but they went seven straight possessions without scoring. They went ice cold in the second half. Duke went on a 10-0 run, and from that 48-39 score, Duke outscored Wisconsin 29-15 the rest of the way. So the Blue Devils get their fifth national title under Coach Mike Krzyzewski, moving him into second place all time behind only John Wood and the Badgers. It looked like destiny was on their side the way they had played throughout the game, but they go out with a defeat to the Blue Devils. Frank Kaminsky had 21 points, 12 rebounds. Sam Decker, only 12 points, 8 rebounds. He was kind of silent for much of the night, and his three-point shooting was not on par with what he did against Arizona in the West Regional and Kentucky on Saturday night. Uh, the Badgers' backcourt was really outplayed. And Trayvon Jackson, you have to feel bad for this guy because he missed a huge chunk of the year. And he's going to be the guy that's going to hear it on Twitter. About, you know, I read a lot of tweets. Why don't they get Jackson out? He's horrible. He lost the ball a couple of times and was taken out of the game. But that started the, the Blue Devils' comeback. Bronson Koenig got a nice game. He had 10 points. But the Badgers' backcourt defense may have been what cost them this game. Tyus Jones did finish with 23. He and Allen were the difference. Okafor had two huge baskets late in the second half when Duke did take the lead. But for the most part, all night long, he was outplayed by Kaminsky. And it's shocking when you think about it that the way Duke ends up winning this game is a lot like it was back in December when Tyus Jones had 22 against Wisconsin. They never found a way to stop him. I thought we'd see Josh Gosser on him defensively. He took Quinn Cook, who's another great offensive player, and shut him down for the most part. But it was Jones driving to the basket in the second half, and the Badgers just could not stop it. It's unfortunate because it's been the, the wildest ride for the Badgers uh, in basketball in 74 years. And people will remember it for the final score of the championship game for the most part. And that's sad because now who knows when Wisconsin will get a chance to get back to this point. Frank Kaminsky's graduating, going to the NBA. Sam Decker most likely entering the NBA draft. Trayvon Jackson, Duye Dukin both graduating. So it won't be the same team. They've had a tremendous two-year run to the final four semifinals last year, to the championship game this year, but they lose to Duke. We have uh, live team coverage coming up. We're expecting the Badgers in about 10 minutes or so, uh, maybe 15. They'll be at the podium. We'll hear from Bo Ryan and a couple of the players. Stephanie Sutton is inside getting reaction from the Badgers after this 68 to 63 loss to the Blue Devils. A lot of stunned Badger fans leaving Lucas Oil Stadium after they thought they would see the first time in their lifetime the Badgers win the national championship. Live in Indianapolis, Dan Needles, WISN 12 Sports. Stephen, back to you. Thanks a lot, Dan. Important note, Tyus Jones had 22 points against Wisconsin in the win over Duke on December 3rd, 23 against the Badgers tonight. He was certainly the difference maker in this game. Back to you guys. Choice.